In the studio. <laughs> What's up, everybody? I really wish you wouldn't just insist on doing that. <laughs> Welcome to the, the podcast. Thing. In the studio. What's up, guys? You got to get in the enthusiasm the going for the first podcast. We're not in the studio we're at really all. Studio. We're in the garage. Yeah, we're just in my dad's garage, just chilling here. Just um, trying to make the first podcast. Waiting on the world to change. Waiting on the world to change. Everything. That's all we can really do. <laughs> I don't know. But Welcome to... Yeah. Our dopey little podcast. The first ever episode of the Zach and Ariel Hour. I really wish. Last an hour. I don't. That wasn't the name. That's, that's because it's not going to be the name. I don't think that's going to be don't, the name. Don't even think that's the name of the podcast because he's never going to call that it ever the Z- again. The Colgate Comedy Hour. That's even worse. <laughs> With Sound Zach like toothpaste. Miller and, yeah, yeah was, we're not just putting the government names out there. No, nah, yeah. Colgate's totally going to sue us. Z Mills. That was already a thing back. Z Mills, yeah. No, it probably should be the uh The Z Mills and Ship Hour. <sighs> no. The Z Mills and Ship Adventures. The Delaware Comedy Podcast, man. I think Shout that's out to the three oh two. The three oh two. Holding it down. Yeah, man. But yeah, how you doing, buddy? I'm doing What's good. What's new dude. with you? What's new with you? So if we're gonna talk to these three people to that the are masses, gonna be listening to so many listeners to our podcast. We should definitely say some stuff about ourselves. So I would like to say that Zach is going to introduce himself first. <laughs> I'm going to introduce myself. Yeah, my name's my name's Zach. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Dude. I uh, go by it's Z Mills. Z Mills is introducing Z-Mills. himself. That's just my rap name. Not really. Nah. Not, didn't I even don't drop one in the shower. Not what? <laughs> <laughs> when I'm alone at night, shower. I can't sleep. I drop a few bars. No big deal. In my head, <laughs> but. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, <coughs> I'm just in trying to, head. just a boy trying to make it in the world, you know what I mean? I'm Zach, yeah, I try to, uh, I I do comedy, I try to be a stand-up comic, you can check out my videos on YouTube, I'm trying to okay, make, we're not a po- in. make a podcast. I'm we're not plugging in our stuff, man, you might as well just plug in your Instagram and Twitter. <laughs> no, we're just going to keep gonna be that. on the That's going to be on the, the blog when the episodes come out, we got this shit, bro, we're get, we right. got it. We're well, we're franchising, man. We're gonna be like fucking. We're gonna take over. <laughs> we're gonna be like Kraft mac and cheese, or like Wawa, or something. What, we're, gonna we're gonna take, take over, over the globe. Yeah, man. We're Wawa is take taking over. over. Wawa is taking over, dude. Shout out to Wawa, straight up. Yeah, shout out to Wawa. Wawa. Yes. And Wawa's shout out to the awesome. Piggly Wiggly, dude. The Piggly Wiggly, but yeah, what do you? But yeah, I'm just uh, you know, I'm from Delaware. I'm uh, I'm, a, I'm a weird kid, I guess. I was. We're not going that far back <laughs> in history, dude. I grew up. <laughs> We're done. <laughs> We're but done yeah, but yeah, man, say say All some right, things about yourself. What's up, Area Walker? Dude, this is not the whole. Say name. what's up to the world. Yeah, not, not the whole name. Not. I'm sorry. What yeah, the, yeah. I'm sorry. What is wrong with you? I don't know. The government yeah. is come after. The government. Yeah. All yeah, right. That's true. Uh, the people call me Shib. Why? Shout out to dude. Where's my car so I don't get sued? That's why my name is Shib. If you've seen that movie, you'll understand. But anyway, yeah, That's a great I just kill it one day at a time. That's my life. <laughs> Where? <laughs> if I had some music to go, I was real late. I just stepped away from the mic. I wish people put, could see that. Put Kid Cudi back on. Dude. Some shit. No. That's my life. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's a good, yeah. We've been friends. Good since enough intro. The fifth grade. Yeah, we've been friends for a while, man. You're and like, he's always talked about making a stupid little podcast. I did. I well, I used to make a he podcast made one with, with this my, Jew guy. my friend Tommy. Yeah, shout out to Tommy. The shout Jew. out to Tommy. He's he's a good kid. He's doing. I don't think he uh, actually was that Jewish. I think he kind of exaggerated yeah, his I really Jewishness. Think he did because I'm pretty sure I saw him like have a Christmas tree. Yeah, he does. <laughs> he came in with a fucking Santa Claus hat one day, like Tommy. Like, no, nah, he. My neighbor, oh no, he tried to be. Real, yeah, he. I think he did for just the laughs and like he just wanted to be Jewish. But like, big 
But no, he's but he a, grew into he's it. a good guy, and uh, he's doing well. It seems like, and uh, we dude, made a pretty good podcast. Wawa. We yeah. saw him at Wawa. Yeah, we saw him again. At Wawa, shout yeah. out to Wawa. Yeah, dude, you run into everybody at Wawa. Wawa's and great. then when you go into Bear and go into Wawa, old men just want to fuck in. I mean, just homeless ass guys are always asking you for money. Like, there's like four homeless guys just yeah. Want some and in change some cases, all the time. when I was they in just, Bear picking up uh, this girl that I know. And we were driving out of her neighborhood, and I saw someone I used to work with who happens to do, you know, some drugs. And I saw her riding riding a little kid bike that I know she stole in <laughs> order to probably get some drugs. Probably stole from a child to, tra- <laughs> to get some drugs. Don't do drugs, people. Don't be like that. Yeah. Just probably. smoke weed. Yeah, dude. Don't do drugs. Smoke weed. Yeah. Seriously. Message like, to the kids. Mess- seriously, <laughs> if you guys want to smoke weed, you better yeah. wait. <clears throat> not this, not this shit. I'm yeah, don't, don't about kids. Oh, now I'm getting all eating people's off. faces off and well, shit. Okay. Don't be doing bath salts I never, or fucking. Oh, oh yeah, like some yeah. That's throwing it back. A gonna do some ago. zombie when shit. Did the bath salt thing happen? That happened. I don't know. It was a couple years ago. I was think. it? Were we in high school? I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not, we were in high school. Okay. yeah, yeah. I think we were. It was like. Two years ago or some shit. Everybody yeah. was like, "My dad was like, are you doing bath salts?' Like, I don't yeah. even know what. Am I going? Go- right. Am I going in the bathroom and doing drugs, man? Like, I'm good. Like, what are you talking? About? I know, like, I like salty foods, but that doesn't mean I'm just gonna. <laughs> yeah, be man, like, I love salt. Bath salts. I love man. sunflower seeds. <laughs> you know, sunflower seeds. <laughs> yeah, well, that yeah. Everybody loves sunflower seeds. I. No, I used to really enjoy sunflower seeds, like a whole different level. You really did. You yeah, had dude, four o'clock in dedicated. I couldn't seats. call this was my when ritual. we were younger when people actually had house phones. Yeah. I guess yeah, I'm crazy okay. because I have a house phone in 2014 and this guy <laughs> is too cool for one. Get the fuck out of here with your house phone, dude. What are you doing? Dude. You're trying to live in like, you, what are you doing? When people You're like in the 60s, man? When appointments and stuff like that, they, I okay. think they would, I would rather prefer my doctor call my century, house this bitch. than have my cell phone number. Like, I don't want no, my man. hose and my doctor to hit the same phone. <laughs> Why not, man? That's, that's everybody Maybe my at the touch my of doctor. your fingertips. Nah, what if one of your hose is injured and you need to call the doctor? No, nah, then... You need to call your personal doctor. Dude, she's, she's for the one hose. of the hose for the reason. I don't take care of stuff. <laughs> she, oh, that's you, not don't, my job. you don't go that, that far that's into it. That's not my job, dude. That's not your job. My, my bad, yo. I'll call somebody, but then I'm piecing the fuck out. But no, I feel you. I mean... Yeah, I don't know why. My parents just totally got rid of the house phone a while ago. I've seen other people, like, other uh, homes don't have a house phone either. I think people are just doing away with it nowadays. But I... Screw I, them. No disrespect to you with the house phone. Keep I, it up, dude. I disrespect you. Get an old school ass house, house, house phone with, like, you got to turn it with the whole uh, no, cord, walk around the house and extend it and no, play with it. We have Twiddle two. it with your fingertips, like, like fucking 1993, we dude. We have two. Have fun. <laughs> like, just enjoy it. We have two you cordless can. phones. Both or electronic. We get fucking eye chips in our... or eye, We get little little chips in our eyes and we can... What? <laughs> got a little Google Chrome what you, in our eyelids. <laughs> or uh, Google Glasses. Glass and shit like Ears. that. Shut Before up. we got, like, space shuttles and shit. We're going to space. And blow up the whole world. All right, anyway. So enjoy the cordless phone, man. Enjoy the retro shit. Yeah, dude. <laughs> my, my parents have an old cordless phone. It's pretty cool. It's fun. I'm looking at your... Prank call people on a cordless phone and act like you're in middle school. You have a VHS and a DVD thing. Yeah, man. We could, Shout out to that. That's dude. what I'm saying, I, used, I, I have one of those have in my that. room. But no, we can... The, th- the best thing is when I learn how to actually podcast like a professional, we can put DVDs and we can put VHSs and we can record the sound clips from those. We can try it tonight. We can record the sound clips and put in the podcast. Fuck, yeah. I just found a tape. Yeah, I don't know what it is. A digital video cassette. Dude, I probably... There's a lot of That's those. from like 1996. Yeah, I think dude. the dust on this is physically from 1996. <clears throat> I think it's in the house. Yeah, but sure. this kid and I... Yeah, hey, we've been we, friends for a while. We used to do some crazy shit. We used to we crack each do, other up. We still do crazy shit. There's, yeah, we used to we get in the trouble. We high school because middle school was so intense... For us and our parents, because we would just do dumb shit. I remember one time we got yelled at because we called these girls lesbians. Oh, yeah. That was... 
Okay, yeah. let's it makes look. It sound let's, bad. Let's no. Nah. Okay, <laughs> let's recall. We were how really we young now. Though. One, we didn't say they're a les. Well, he did. I didn't. I just I thought it was I, funny. If I straight out called them lesbians, I might have asked them implied. if they were lesbians because they that's put, a I question. Love you on some but I mean, it wasn't part. like I remember that clear as day. I'm fine with them being lesbians. Like, no, let's okay. Let's think. There was <laughs> two girls. Problem. Wasn't hate speech. One girl. Has a child now. But maybe that's... A she had a child and dropped out of high school at maybe 17. And then the other one was 6'5". They're probably never In the fifth grade. I hope not. I'm just saying. They're probably... Yeah. No, no, no. They're... Yeah. Like, it's not even like you were saying it to, like, people who were, like, doing a lot of stuff in life. They gave <laughs> up. They threw in the towel not too long after that incident, if you think about it. They probably don't even remember See, you know that. what? Maybe they should be lesbians. Go ahead. Yeah. Maybe we'll be better in life well, I mean, being a lesbian. It doesn't really matter either way. But yeah, I remember that because they wrote some like weird shit and we found it. You found just... it, dude. It was all <laughs> you. What do you mean we? I, think I was in your home room. She wrote her some notes uh, and put it in the cubby. I think I just got you in trouble. You got me in trouble. I was I a douche, it. dude. It was I was right crazy. Before, it was right before like, some Christmas vacation or whatever. Because I thought one of those and girls fa- was real my hot. My family and I, yeah, she was hot. But She's then pr- like, and she peaked crazy, in like dude. eighth grade, dude. Don't you hate that when that happens? But like, that just made, but we used to do some crazy shit. We used to did you lose just your run shoe? around and make people think we were insane? Yeah, just take our shoe. That was just me. I used to do some just crazy you used to take shit. My <laughs> shoe. Just follow me. Yeah. It's all the hot girls. Yeah. That aren't hot anymore. Oh, shout out to that. Dude. I mean, they were like all right, hot Pete. in middle school. Was they even mean? Yeah. We thought they were real hot. They that's what they be now. <laughs> Every single wow. girl that I thought was hot in middle school, I think maybe one is sexy. Really? Day. One? Mm-hmm. That's calling out the whole <laughs> new art charge. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I'm out for it. <laughs> Straight called you guys out, 2008 class. Step your shit Yo, up. that's so... <laughs> I disagree. I don't even know. I don't even know. That's craziness. I and think that's definitely girl, not did true. Go to high school with me too. There's some pretty and she good. She was sexy throughout high school. <coughs> Everything else is just a lost cause. God. <laughs> <laughs> no man, I think that, that, we went if to. If they s- were hot then, <laughs> they're not hot now. Yeah. I, nah, I just I think. Hmm. I don't know. I haven't seen yeah, a lot of people in a while. Sunny. It's kind of weird. <laughs> <laughs> class of 2000. I love you, class of 2008. We were killing it back Dude, then. It was a great class. Yeah. Shout out to all the ladies, all the all the guys in class two thousand eight, New York Charter dude, School. Fuck you. Shit was nuts, Shout dude. Shout out to all of you motherfuckers. Yeah, dude. But if we went to high school together, we definitely oh, would have gotten kicked out. Yeah, we would have but no, if you and I went to high oh, school we together, we definitely kill. one of us would have gotten expelled. One of us we probably both would have had to transfer schools. Yeah. <laughs> like if we would we messed with each other too much. Yeah, dude. I every time I felt the need, every time I saw you in middle school, I felt the need to <laughs> fuck with you. <laughs> and I still feel that to this very day sometimes. It's not every second of every day like it was in middle school. Yeah. <laughs> but it's I in high school it would have been so much worse. Like in the middle of class I would have just thrown like a binder at your head. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. <laughs> really? And then we stepped it up. Now. You're just throwing <laughs> shit in my textbooks. <laughs> in the literature book, right? Dude, I used to throw, like, I used to throw so much shit. No, these two yeah. kids who sat in the back of my class in my English class in my 10th grade year, they would just throw spitballs up at the ceiling on the ceiling tiles. That's just, disgusting. And there would be, like, so much and it would just fall down <sighs> after a little bit wait was that in high school that was in high school DNA? I went to yeah. military school ladies and gentlemen that's crazy yeah and that happened there now, no that happened at St. Mark's definitely a couple of times yeah it's still a that. high school at the it's, same time yeah, we were a pretty good high school we didn't happens. have a lot of fights we didn't really yeah. people had beef <laughs> everybody at my high school fought in the neighborhood next to us they would like schedule it make videos of it and, like a bunch of fucking pussies <laughs> guys come to the fight in like the nicest neighborhood ever <laughs> Like the rich neighborhood next to the school. That's hilarious. Dude. Bunch of fucking. We just white kids got beef for no reason. Nah, I was I got in one fight in high school and I looked up and like a quarter of my high school was in the hallway. That's 
crazy. And then I gave the finger to my ex-girlfriend and high five my buddy and went straight to the principal's office like a thug. Yeah. <laughs> and then I was like, I don't know, I'm suspended. I might as well go out like a G. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, you... Yes, I'm surprised he didn't go out at eighth grade fucking Miss Jensen. Couldn't go to Hershey Please, Park, like man. I fucking her. <laughs> Go out, fucking, fucking fucking Miss fucking Jensen. Miss, yeah, it's nah. Weird. Yeah, lady yeah. You didn't. Permitted. You didn't have sex with Miss Jensen. Mm. That would be Old, weird. Wrinkly ass. That would be real uncomfortable if you did. For everybody who was involved. I don't know if I could hang out with you for a little bit. I, like if I, I heard did, about dude, that. I wouldn't. Back then, I'd be like, dude, I gotta give it like a few weeks. So yeah. I just gotta process this. I just gotta think about the whole okay. thing that's happening. I just gotta not be nah, home. but like, one teacher that we did love. Female-wise. There were, there were some attractive grade, teachers. Grade, not eighth no grade. School. Spanish teacher. <laughs> she was great. Yeah, she was cool. She was a hot tamale. She's a cool lady. She yeah. still is a hot tamale. Yeah, man. Shout out to her, though. Yeah. I hope she never listens to this. I hope she does. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that fucking song we made for her? Yeah, so we left on her, uh, her daughter. Samantha's her. mom. We called Sam, and we are like, we yeah. want to sing your mom a song. song. She's like, dude, she's really? she's like, <laughs> Why? Right. Yeah, and cool. we're like, Samantha's mom's it's got... got and we, we had the part where she walked sweet. in with a towel on in, yeah, spa- in Spanish, cl- and she's like, <laughs> she what are you guys talking about? I never walked in like, with just a towel on. That is inappropriate. Yeah, she was like, I just want to talk to you guys about one part of the song. Yeah. <laughs> and then Zach immediately went, the part with the towel. <laughs> 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 Yeah. Yes, I've never <laughs> walked in Spanish class. <laughs> <laughs> Ciao. <laughs> I immediately that knew that she was referring laugh. to that. I guess. Yeah. Still the makes done me bar, dude. Very day. She's a great lady. She's though. cool. She's, She's a great really lady. Cool. She's a nice lady. Yeah. She was a hot smiley for having like three or four kids. Yeah, definitely. Mm-hmm. That's awesome. Great. Kept job. it up. Yeah, she was a cool teacher she too. She was a little like crazy a sometimes, but she, really, she was into Brad, Brad Pitt a lot. She was oh, like, yeah, I she love had Brad, Brad Pitt. Pitt's yeah, she really wanted to fuck Brad Pitt. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Brad Pitt's always chilling there when we're doing Spanish. Just staring into our soul. Cause, was he? Cause he's not us, Spanish. He played the Mexican, Mike, yeah, like us an asshole. Mike and I sat Mexican. in front in Spanish class. I remember that we were the first three seats in front of her desk. And then we would just see Brad Pitt staring into our soul while we were trying to cheat during the test. <laughs> yeah, dude. Brad Pitt's judging me. It's like, dude, Brad Pitt's looking at me. I can't get your answer. It's fucking C. Dude. Have you seen Legends of the Fall? It's beautiful. It's like, dude, did you not understand the first rule of Fight Club? What's in the box? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Brad Pitt's cool. Shout out to Brad Pitt. It is cool, dude. Like, he's killing it, man. Yeah, man. A huge dump on my life, man. Yeah, definitely, dude. We're definitely gonna be Brad, but like, I think we might not individually become Brad Pitts, but colle- like between the two of us, we can make Brad Pitt. <laughs> make the hell? Brad Pitt. Yeah, dude. We'll be successful enough to make one Brad Pitt, hopefully one day. I'm so down. <laughs> and we'll hang out. Just be like, I think we got a Brad Pitt. Thing. <laughs> one day, I'm gonna be like, dude, we definitely are vibing on the Brad Pitt thing. I told you. We're oh making a Brad dude. Pitt action. That's so funny. I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> but I yeah, mean, dude. he did start he is a Fight Club in Delaware. Yeah. And that's where we are. Again, <coughs> that is pretty cool. Yeah. But I don't know if he started Fight Club in Delaware. <laughs> mm-hmm. He didn't write that movie. But Tyler like, Durden. He's Tyler Durden. Yeah, he is fucking Tyler Whether Durden, likes it or dude. Not, he's, he's Tyler, Tyler Durden. Durden. But people don't remember that. It's cool. It's so a good I book, like, too. Who's, if I was like, Tyler Durden. Who's Tyler Durden? Yeah. Fight Club. Oh yeah, Brad Pitt's in that with his shirt. Oh on. my god, I saw that one. Sit scene down. Where he had his shirt. Sit on. down. You know another one that girls like go crazy over. Never back down. Ever see that movie? Never back down with it. Who? I don't know. It's like some kind of punk ass version of that, a little teenage version of that came out in 2010. <laughs> I think I. And I saw it in high school. Girls like that movie. Girls love that movie. Never back down. I think I know. I I know that movie. I know His that title. Kid, he got in trouble or some shit like that in school. And he started fighting or whatever. Oh, 2008? Oh, 2008? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, we watched it freshman year, 2009. All right. Oh. <clears throat> At his high school, a teen is lured into an underground fight club where he finds a mentor in a mixed martial arts veteran. Sean Ferris, Digimon, Hans, Amber Heard, I don't know. Digimon. Digimon, yeah, sorry. Is it Digimon? 
I'm sorry. He's a good actor, though. I've seen him. <laughs> Shout out Digimon, yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Digimon. Oh, this dude. This guy is such a douche. Remember this guy? Wait, what's he in? This bastard. I don't even know. He's in Easy A. Yeah, wait, let me see. Yeah. But yeah, man, nobody knows what we're talking about. Yeah, like, I really but yeah, never back, back down. I've seen. I remember seeing the trailer for that movie. It's just because never probably he has down. his shirt off and yeah, like, oh my always God. fighting shit, fighting people. Oh, <laughs> punching bags, sweaty action. Also, step up. Ladies dude. love those. Like the first step up, dude. No, or like all the love step up. All the step. Up. I don't know how many. Yeah, they came There's out with that many like fucking 12. step ups. They I obviously love the step up action, dude. There's like five of them. Like I'll give it to you. You're stepping up that much that you need five movies. That's how much you're stepping up. You know what I was can't a good keep up movie with that. that we saw? I saw the first the one giver. on a bus on band trip. All these were like, we brought Step Up. Step Up. Why? Why do you continuously bring Step, step up? up? We're going to Canada. Step Up. Why are year. we watching that the whole trip? It's like as soon as it ended, boom. I, main menu play movie. We just started over. I think we should watch again. Step Up again. No. No, we also watched Twilight. Nah, also, ew, that's even all the, worse, yeah, dude. The, the ladies Just brought all the movies. Just tell them to movies. sit down, dude. You're like, what happened? But a good movie that we saw recently was The Giver. The Giver was amazing, I don't amazing, know, yeah. back to Newark Charter School, we went there. We saw that movie. No, not movie. Uh, we read that Yeah, book. we read that book back in Charter. That was cool. And it was a great book. That's so what the kid looks it. like now, dude. It was a. It he was looks amazing. like he's going to molest somebody. Yeah. But that's cool. Anyway, yeah, it's about this... I'm not gonna say what it's about because I pretty much just give away the movie. It's about a. It's, it's about a. If uh, you read the book, you will be extremely satisfied with the movie. Yeah, it's a di- it to- did, dystopian. It was, it's so great. Futuristic, kind of like weird town, and this kid kind of discovers everything. He's given the. Yeah, I don't really. There we go. It's about it. Yeah, you're really just describe. Him kinda, the whole yeah, you can't movie. really describe it without. Taylor Swift but shows it's a really up. Good, Taylor in the Swift shows of up. The movie. She has a cameo. And up I'm in there. looking here, and she's one of the top billed casts. Yeah, she's. No problem with Taylor Swift because everybody seems to come at her, and I feel bad. Yeah. But still, she had a real short cameo in that she movie. She was in there for about 45 minutes. It didn't really make any sense, and then. Yeah, but that's oh, the only yeah. thing. Yeah, Angry Dave's coming. Angry Dave's gonna make guest appearance. Be aware. No, <laughs> building up suspense. <laughs> no, it's all good. But um, <laughs> yeah, that movie is really good. I, I think the was really I recommend good. the Giver. If you read the book and you like the book, the book's amazing. See it. If you didn't see it anyway, it's. In the studio. <laughs> Sorry, no, I'm, just not, I'm not doing that. What did I tell you again. about doing? I feel like stupid an idiot. in the studio. <laughs> But yeah, my, sorry about that. Nobody even knows. We just come, came right back. But we had to pause the recording for a sec. Angry Dave was coming in hot. He didn't even come in upstairs. No, he no, he's, he just, he's just fucking with us. He definitely yeah. opened the door. Just stood there. Yeah, we should definitely have him on, though. No, definitely got him on. He's gonna hit one of us in the face. <laughs> no, <man. laughs> Dude, I remember Tommy would always try to fuck with him. That was really funny. He would just try to ask him questions that he knew he would be pissed about. Or like he thought he would. And my dad was just like, you're an idiot. But yeah, I actually, my dad's crazy though. My dad's hilarious. Angry Dave, fucking driving with Angry Dave. Dude, your dad would be the best guest to have. I don't know why. Was it, I remember as soon as we did this, we did this project in middle school. And it was Zebra Wink. That was the name of the product. And we had to put something on that line. <laughs> yeah, and we crazy. were a bunch yeah. of clowns. And we said, oh, let's do underwear. Yeah. We did zebra wink underwear, and I don't know why. Immediately, I was like, "We need Angry Dave in the video." Like you and me, I think we we're like, "We need yeah. to have Angry Dave in the video." Angry Dave's got to be in it. He's, He's hilarious. Be in it. Yeah, and but he didn't. He didn't want to be in it at first. You want to watch it on YouTube? Stuff. Check out don't, zebra wink please underwear. Don't check it out on YouTube. Just type in zebra wink underwear, or is that? Uh, yeah, please don't. That's all you gotta do. I'm begging you. Do it. But yeah, really I actually cool. record. My dad, while driving, one day, and him screaming at people because every time we drive somewhere, it will only take like three minutes for him to start flipping out and wanting to kill somebody. So I like got a little clip, but I'm gonna play it's it. It's so funny, dude. Let's fucking do play it. it. I'm gonna play it. Hold on. Oh! 
don't know, man. He's fucking driving down the fucking road doing 30 fucking 8 miles an hour. Yeah, that was all I got. But more to come. More to come. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that, that would be seriously hilarious. all you wanted to play? <laughs> <laughs> that was all I had. I honestly thought there was more than that. I'm sorry. I thought it was a good idea. But it was still funny. It's really funny. It it's like so the best funny. 10 seconds. Just my 10. 38 fucking long. <laughs> He's just so he specific, just dude. He's just always snapping. But yeah. But yeah, my dad's going to be pissed if he hears I put that on the podcast. You just got to keep recording him. Real man. Yeah. Like I heard you record. I think you're, no, you're you on. Coming up in my grill, dude. <laughs> no, it's all good. It's just checking if your mic's on. I, I can do it myself. <laughs> I don't doubt you. I'm sorry. Fucking you come in on. I'm just concerned for you. You know, I want you to do well. I want you to excel, man. You're my friend, you know. I hope you want the same for me. Be dude. my friend. Be my friend. Be my friend. <laughs> yeah. But Be my friend, dude. Yeah, on this next episode that we're going to have, we're going to have... Uh, guests off the on the show, and who it is? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have some guests next time. We're Mary's definitely gonna do a lot of interviews with a lot of interesting people. You know, we're gonna have uh, comedians and and uh, artists. No, we're not. Like. We're just gonna have, like, a couple no, of we're gonna have we're gonna have some cool guests. We're gonna have our own friends and fam, and you know, crazy people that we find. It's gonna be real, man. We're gonna we got this shit, Ariel. Why you look? Why you look like you? Don't <laughs> why you not into it? Too? We're definitely gonna it be wasn't that I wasn't into it. No, but I just burped and it tasted like. But seriously, really we're bad. definitely gonna have. Uh, we're not gonna have any big name guests, but we're gonna have interesting people on. We're gonna have interesting conversations. So hopefully, you guys tune in. This was a little introduction episode, you know, if you will. What's the message of the day, Ariel? What you got for me, though? That's what I'm saying. What are we trying to teach the kids today? Okay, if we're gonna have a message that we're gonna teach the youth it's that if you date someone and your friends don't like him dump but it. anyway <laughs> you're out you should turn off the mic again I'm outie nah I don't even know I guess that's a that's a message to keep to get. yeah but really though that's kind of true your friends opinions do mean a lot your friends are greater. Your friends than your significant. Yeah, your friends always know what's best for you. I think. Not to sound good like friends, a like uh, you know. But your friends will be there before your significant other. Definitely. And they will be there after. No your doubt. Significant other. That is absolutely true. So if they give you advice on something, and all of your other friends agree, <laughs> listen to them. Don't run off to New York. But also. And watch a stupid video Kids, that's nine minutes long. Life is what you make of it. You know what I mean? Again. Just always strive for the best. Keep your head up. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Just work hard. Dude, Just be not, the best person you can be. We're not infomercial people. <laughs> like, we don't have to give good messages here. I'm just sorry. Yeah. I'm just kidding. But for real, though. Listen to your friends. All right? Definitely. I'm not saying if they said jump off a bridge. Yeah, do if you've it. been friends with somebody for a while, and you know their opinion. And if the person has dropped numerous <laughs> girls for you, and they they got some serious booty, <laughs> and they listen to you and get no tail, uh, and then when they give you advice, and you're just like, you cannot give me any advice. <laughs> just saying. Damn. Show them out. I'm done. Good night, people. Two stoners <laughs> in a garage. That should be the name of the this podcast. Actually, I think it will be. <laughs>